I think that this technology is going to reshape pretty much every software category. Rapid innovation is going to come. In fact, a race starts today. Microsoft Supply Chain Center allows us to make the best decision possible to get the product there as fast as we can. Everything is being invoiced automatically. As a result, every month is our best selling month. In the Microsoft stack, we're very enamored with the machine learning tools and the reporting functions. That's why we've chosen Microsoft to achieve and to raise the security bar as we did. It's becoming really exciting. Hey everyone, my name is Charles Amana, and I'm the Corporate Vice President of Business Applications and Platforms at Microsoft. Whether this is your first time joining us or your ninth, welcome to the 2023 Release Wave 1 launch event. Twice a year in April and October, we hold this event to celebrate the incredible innovation across Microsoft Dynamics 365 and the Power Platform. And today, I'm excited to be here with other product leaders to introduce the latest features we're going to talk about some game-changing capabilities. We're going to discuss AI and how it is transforming business applications and creating an entire new generation of user experiences and workflows. If we take a brief history lesson, we'll see that business applications have looked the same for the last 40 years. We're talking about ERP, CRM, and all the other different three and four letter acronyms. Yes, they are hosted and delivered in new ways, but the user experience and core workflows are unchanged. Take the contact center 40 years ago. It would be running with a mainframe application and a terminal-based user interface. And people would be doing a lot of the same things you see today, looking at a list of inventory, invoices, drilling into details of orders, and managers looking at reports. Fast forward a bit and you get to personal computers and client server architecture like Windows 95. Now you have graphical user interfaces and servers behind the scenes, but people are still looking at a list of records, drilling into details, and looking at reports. Now, if we jump to the last 15 years, we see the emergence of SaaS and browser-based applications, but the underlying experience is still the same. Users still log into a system. They still get a list of inventory orders or customers, and they still generate reports. The good news is that we're entering a new age of AI capabilities. And as a result, business applications will be reimagined at their core. The next 40 years of user experience is going to look very different than the last 40. And my hope for everyone tuning in today is that by the end of the show, you will see what this means from a technology, user experience, and product perspective. We are living through a transition from big data to big AI. 10 years ago, it was all about big data platforms for large data analysis and analytics. We still need those, of course, but now we are in the middle of a seismic shift to big AI models. These so-called foundation models are a new generation of AI that unlock entirely new scenarios and experiences. OpenAI has delivered image generation with DALI, text generation with GPT-3, and the ChatGPT experience. There's no limit to where our imagination can go with these foundation models. And business applications will not be exempt from the transformative power of these AI capabilities. AI is going to be at the heart of our next wave of experiences. It is a platform shift that will be as impactful as the move to personal computers or mobile devices. And at Microsoft, we have the world's most intelligent business applications. Across Dynamics 365, the Power Platform, and Viva Sales, we are in the midst of changing every workflow with AI. These intelligent applications are how we help our customers improve their business processes. CRM and ERP are not going away. We still need to sell products, service those products, fulfill orders, track financials, and so much more. But what we are going to see is a new generation of experiences in CRM and in ERP that look and feel fundamentally different. The good news is that we are committed to doing that within our existing Dynamics 365 apps in a seamless way. By betting on our cloud platform, you will get this functionality in your existing deployments and within your existing licenses. AI is part of every single app. 
At Microsoft, we have been on this journey with AI transformation since 2021, when we first combined our low-code development platform with OpenAI large language models. And over the last four years, we have announced several exciting updates throughout our AI innovation journey. Most recently, we took the next leap in our AI product transformation by introducing Microsoft Dynamics 365 Copilot, which provides AI-powered assistance across every line of business. Let's take a look. Nine out of 10 workers said that automation and AI-powered tools would help them focus on meaningful work. Introducing Microsoft Dynamics 365 Copilot, AI-powered assistance to get more done with less effort and take on the tasks that keep you from the work that matters. From summarizing meeting notes, complete with action items and follow up dates, to helping you get started with emails and content. Whether you're a seller following up with a proposal, a marketer promoting a new product, or a service agent providing world-class customer support. Copilot is there when you need it to suggest responses, documents, and ideas in the moment and get help just by asking in a conversational way. Copilot features can help write a compelling product description for online stores or help find the right audience simply by typing who they want to reach. Copilot can even help with your supply chain by predicting risks before they become a problem and provide clear steps to take action. Copilot is built into Dynamics 365 using artificial intelligence developed responsibly by Microsoft, empowering employees to deliver better customer experiences and drive efficiency across the organization. Dynamics 365 Copilot, the world's first AI copilot in both CRM and ERP. And another example that I want to talk about for these intelligent applications is something we announced last summer, which is the Microsoft Digital Contact Center platform. The Microsoft Digital Contact Center platform brings together Dynamics 365, Power Platform, Nuance, Microsoft Teams, and Azure to help our customers deliver transformative experiences for agents and for their customers through the Contact Center. That enables proactive and intelligent outreach, one-to-many connections via different channels of communication, reinforcement learning, and AI. These systems get better day after day after day based on the engagements and conversations between agents and customers. This is an incredible opportunity to improve customer experience and reduce cost. In fact, this is probably the area with the most near-term impact and value from AI and foundation models. One thing that will really drive this impact is Power Virtual Agents. Part of the Power Platform family, it's a low-code way to rapidly create text or voice-based chatbots. ChatGPT and GPT-3.5 enables conversational capabilities in Power Virtual Agent that are compliant, safe, and secure. To better illustrate how transformational this is, let's look at a demo. Power Virtual Agents is now using GPT to make bot building even easier. Let's look at how we can use GPT to build bots for more powerful conversations. It's easier than ever to get started with GPT-enabled bot creation. All we have to do is provide a pointer to any company-specific information, like agent handbooks, support websites, and proprietary knowledge base articles, and the bot will enable GPT-powered chat over that corpus to surface answers specific to the data source. In this case, I will use our Microsoft website. Once the bot is created, I can immediately test it to see Microsoft-specific bot responses without having to manually author any topics. When you boost your conversations with GPT, the bot will check for any existing manually authored topics that can be triggered. If none are available, the new GPT feature kicks in to find the right answer by searching across the various tenant data sources provided. We can identify relevant content from multiple different web pages on their website. GPT gathers this content and paraphrases a friendly, accurate response to return to the customer, improving traditional search capabilities. And remember, all we've done is provide one website address to the bot. With this feature, Power Virtual Agent solves two key problems for the industry. First, bots will be able to answer questions instantly out of the box, dramatically disrupting the traditional multi-month bot development cycle. Second, bots can now combine manually authored topics, which deliver on specific use cases, with the vast knowledge across the tenant's corpus, expanding the ability for bots to fulfill employee and customer needs and lower escalation rates, which provides a greater cost savings and ultimately a better user experience. This is just the beginning of what's possible with GPT and Power Virtual Agents. 
Try it out for yourself at aka.ms slash try PVA. Most business today is still people working side by side on tasks, processes, and outcomes. But in the future, we'll be in a world where people work side by side with AI. And given the pace of change, that future may be just two or three years away. Business apps will bring together a workforce of people and AI bots and agents to go faster. Those who take advantage of the shift will soon discover their most creative and efficient work. According to IDC, by 2026, 85% of organizations will mix humans and AI. And we're going to see a 25% improvement in productivity as a result. That does not happen every decade or every generation, but it is happening now. And this release wave is the first big step towards making that true at Microsoft. We are going to spend the rest of the hour exploring all the AI innovation you can expect in this release wave with a great set of product demos and customer stories. And we heard your feedback. You asked for more in-depth content and we're excited to publish over 60 minutes of special topic sessions and bonus content for you to watch on demand after the show. If you want to learn more about our work with large language models, I also encourage you to check out the deep dive with Walter Sun that will be available after the show. In the next section, you'll hear more about the incredible work we're bringing to life for the Digital Contact Center platform in this release wave from Jeff Comstock. And we couldn't be more excited about what will be accomplished in this new era of business applications. Thank you.